it's Kara. Welcome to Champagne Taste on a Beer Budget. Uh, I just wanted to um, come on here, give you guys um, a little update what's going on. So, um, my last video, it was on Wednesday that I filmed it. And I told you guys that I um, had contacted my doctor. I had had symptoms for a couple of days and contacted my doctor. And um, I was giving um, a diagnosis of presumptive positive for uh, COVID-19. And um, that just, I think there was a little confusion. Uh, my doctor sent my info over to the COVID team um, in my medical network. And it was the COVID team that told me that I had COVID-19. So I uh, just wanted to mention that. Um, I'm out of breath. Um, about an hour later, um, I think Pat realized the uh, seriousness of the situation. So, and he had had symptoms for like two days longer than I had. He had not told me some of his symptoms. He was actually getting chills. I didn't even know that. I. I did not even know that. He called his doctor. He told his doctor all of his symptoms. He was a different doctor than mine. He was given also a diagnosis of presumptive positive for COVID. Um, so we've both been sick and, um, well, we're all together at home, right? Um, but we've been sick at home, obviously. Um, since then, that was Wednesday. Um, I had trouble breathing, um, not severe, but just heavy on the chest. I was, I was uh, fearful it was going to get much worse. So um, I did go and get a nebulizer treatment with albuterol. It was only five minutes and it helped a lot. It actually made me like a little bit jittery, which was kind of good. It was kind of welcome because I had been so fatigued. So Friday night, I remember watching YouTube videos thinking, God, I feel pretty good. I think I imagined all of this stuff, all this COVID stuff. Yeah, and then the weekend came, and then <laughs> I have not left my bed really in three days. So um, I've been in bed. Um, I think Saturday I was out of bed for maybe 90 minutes. And then yesterday I was out of bed for about 30 minutes I was eating in bed last night um, I'm sick I'm really sick so um, I do get um, like hot spells fever but then I got I started getting chills on Saturday so I just was in bed Saturday with lots of blankets and everything um, so I remember thinking like Wednesday through Friday, like, oh, this is great. We only have mild symptoms. Well, I still consider this, this is mild. This is like mild COVID, but um, as opposed to has it been the most mild flu or virus I've ever had in my life? No, it's the worst, uh, but it is mild COVID for sure. Uh, well, my, it's mild as far as coronavirus goes and again we didn't um i didn't get the blood test um so i don't know uh, positively but it is monday i have been in bed all day i'm hungry i want to eat but i'm so tired i don't think i could eat i also can't taste food so great anymore like i can taste um there are foods i can taste and foods that i really can't taste so that kind of makes you not want to eat. Um, we do have plenty of supplies in the house, which is great. Um, on the bad side, we did order groceries from a supermarket delivery service and they didn't come today. I ordered them like five days ago. I saw this one window open on Monday and I grabbed it. And then they just haven't shown up. So I don't know what's going on. With that, uh, it's nothing that we certainly need. We have enough to get by, but it would have been nice. It would have been nice had the groceries come. We could have had some different little uh, food options, um, but they haven't come. I don't know. Like, we're both so sick that neither one of us can keep up with anything. Like, can I shoot an email over to the supermarket? No, I can't. I, 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 I just cannot because <laughs> I just will get back in my bed and... I'll just start feeling hot or tired or headachey or whatever and I uh, things are just passing us by um yeah so today's Monday I guess a storm came 
it's actually much more gray in person than it's appearing on the screen. I guess a storm came this weekend. I had no idea. Uh, there was rain on the roof last night, I remember at one point, but missed it. Um, and we have a family member who was out here helping care for Pat's mom before I helped care for Pat's mom. And she now has walking pneumonia. So um, she's awaiting a test too. So um, that's what's going on here. Um, I'm pretty sick, so I won't be doing any YouTube stuff for a little bit. Um, and I have had that like dry rasp, like that dry just um, annoying cough today more than I've had it since last Wednesday. Um, but just wanted to update you guys and if you are, well, you all are, um, probably staying at home, please be very, very careful. Uh, people are getting this, not just people in the newspapers. It could be your neighbors. I've already spoken to my neighbors, um, to let them know and, um, yeah, we do have like Pat's family in the area um, in case anything should happen, but I don't know. I, I think if something really bad was going to happen to us, it would have happened already. Um, I also had a chest x-ray on Friday um, and it was clear, so that's really good to know. And I'm having trouble breathing today, but I'm going to go to the doctor tomorrow and get another nebulizer treatment if I can. I probably should have called about that, right, today, but... Yeah, it's hard. It's just hard to keep up with stuff like that. So, Pat is sick. I am sick. We're sleeping in different rooms to just weeks in each. <clears throat> we can each get our um, sleep when we need it, not disturb each other. So, um, that's what's going on. And uh, if there's any other news, I'll let you guys know. And uh, everybody, just. Stay home. You don't want this. Okay. Um, I'm thinking of all of you. I wish I could go on uh, my phone and say hi to you guys a little bit. I mean, I suppose that I could, but like my eyes are watery and um, I have a lot of headaches and stuff, but maybe that'll happen because I miss talking to you guys. So um, I'll see you guys soon. Um, I don't know. What's my usual closing? Like, comment, subscribe. You don't have to do that. Just, I don't know. Bye, guys. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.